Hi, David Whitehouse here. Uh, we've had a question on Twitter. Brent asks, which is better, HTML5 or Flash? As you know, HTML5 has video support. Which one performs better? That raises a very good question. If those of you don't know what Flash is, Flash was a, a way of showing animation on the web, which was used very early on when the web came out. It started to dwindle out over time, and HTML5 started to take over that. And it's really, when you see any animation on any website, it's either gonna be Flash or HTML5 whereas 80% of the ones on their web are HTML5. And that's for a very good reason. What's happened is Flash was something that you had to install as an extra onto your browser. So your browser being Internet Explorer, Google Chrome, whatever you use, there's always an extra install you had to put on to, to view these uh, videos and these sort of animations and things like that. Whereas when HTML5 came out, it allowed for animation to be played without any extra add-on. So Flash often caused many problems for people and you might have seen it before where you've got, tried to view content and it just didn't work and it asked you to install this extra plugin. And also with the increase of mobile technology, Flash doesn't work on mobile devices. It works on some Android devices and you have to install certain things, but again, very clunky, it just doesn't work, it just doesn't work nicely. So Google rolled out this whole thing where they had a lot of the original videos in uh, Flash format and they rolled it all out now that they're all in HTML5 and a lot more people are using HTML5 video on the web because it just plays. You don't need any extra plugins, any installations or anything like that. It just plays beautifully. So it's not really a case of does HTML5 perform better. It's more of a case it, it performs on more platforms and it's more easy to accessible. It's more user friendly. And HTML5 obviously also has the advantage that you can do a lot of smoother transitions. You can interact with other things in the web, whereas Flash is on a separate platform. These animations are always going to be standalone, and you can get things that pull in and out again, but they, they don't work very well. So HTML5 is the way forward, really, and if you do see any websites with Flash on, it's worth recommending them that they do upgrade the website, because chances are you won't be able to view it on a mobile phone. Thanks for watching.